The driver and the spotter must maintain visual contact at all times during the backing or the driving in process. The spotter is bombarded with distractions. He's looking at form work, footers, rebar, other vehicles, mobile equipment, other workers, and many other things. Any of these other elements can cause the spotter to lose mirror sight with the mixer truck and the driver or the spotter may even step out of mirror sight. What's up? If you, the driver, lose sight of the spotter during the backing process, you must stop that truck immediately. Now, if the spotter steps back into mirror sight and you can see him signal clearly, then you may resume slowly backing. If the spotter doesn't return to mirror sight, then you've got to stop the truck, engage the brakes, dismount from the cab, and immediately walk to the spotter. Determine if there is a safety hazard or issue that the spotter has seen or that he's encountered. If there is no hazard, briefly explain that the spotter must return to mirror sight with correct hand signals for you to continue backing. Return to the cab. Now you may continue the slow backing process. The cardinal rule is, if that spotter steps out of mirror sight, you must immediately stop the truck until you can clearly see the spotter in your mirrors. Are you getting the picture now? You're the delivery professional. The spotter is a volunteer. You're coaching and guiding the spotter to help you rather than assuming the spotter automatically knows to how to guide and direct you. As you take the lead with the spotter, let's move on.